the urban stealth camper van man. You know it makes sense. A conspiracy free zone. Well, hello. Actually, God, that sounded well creepy. <laughs> Um, hello, how about can just hello and stop being a dickhead? I'll have a, I'll have a Yorkie bar in a minute and a man the fuck up. Right, um, still haven't got a van yet, so uh, I thought I will surprise, surprise. I thought I'll show you a bit of uh, a bit of funky artwork. It's a Sunday. What else are you gonna do? Watch a van life channel, maybe. Esther Anson, that's life. Why not watch a bit of uh, fantastic? Abstracty, kind of freaky. This need, guy needs medication. Artwork. Right, so brace yourself. Right. I'll be back. Right, let's start with the small one first, as she said. <coughs> right, this one. Oh, Jesus Christ. This one is called uh, Not. Not at number 10. Let me just see it because uh, if you can reflect it because it's glass. Um, yeah. Not at number 10. Who are? Canton are. Right. Um, where am I? Hold on. Let's have a commercial break first because uh, I'm fucking roasting in here. It is so fucking warm. I've got um, an old fan above my bed and I think the bearing, I had a car like that once so the gearbox was on its way out and you could hear the bearings I think that's what's happening a bit of a dodgy comparison from a fucking van to a car but it sounds a little bit metally and grindy so uh, as I know everything about fucking cars I've diagnosed it as the bearings going on my fan so uh, I do apologise if you can hear that fact free and I'm not even sponsored by them Right, uh, where the fuck was I? Um, be back. Right, so, um, this picture, this picture here is called Lost. Right. Oops, let me hold it both hands. It's called Lost. It's a uh, story of my fucking life. But I love that, I think that's really nice, that one. Lost. And I, um, I worked on the frame as well. Yeah. Those of you that were fucking interested, I actually sorted this frame out. <laughs> I don't know why I seem so fucking proud of itself, like, I sorted the frame out. Uh, I don't but I think it, it, it finishes it off, but uh, you know, makes me fucking happy. Just forget the humour me. Right, um, do you know what? I can't even remember what I called this picture. Um, I can't remember them for love nor money, but I'll get back to you, those who are interested. I can't remember what I fucking named it. And it's that one. Oh, dreams, that's it, that's what I called it. Dreams. Dreams. Freaky. Right, um, let's have a look at that one. This one is a, a Bob Ross classic oil painting, but it's an oil painting with a funky twist. There you go. And it, you can hear that. And you can uh, pick it up. It's still, I painted this about a week ago, but the frame is still slightly tacky. Um, let me show you all the textures on it. I don't know how to pick all that crap up, but um, yeah, that's, that's a Bob Ross special. Literally is a Bob Ross special, but um, I like it. It's definitely different. There's one thing I don't particularly 
old landscapes and that I kind of they're all right, but they're not my cup of tea. But uh, um, yeah, so that's a that is a Bob Ross Bob Ross special. Right. Hello. This one is called Forever Grateful. I bet you'll be forever grateful when this shit's finished. <laughs> called Forever Grateful. It's in the same frame as uh, as the other one, but um, Forever Grateful. A bit funky that one. Forever Grateful. Right, um, I suppose, do you know what, I suppose that's about it. I'm going to relax myself and enjoy my Pepsi Max Cherry and uh, take this freaking t-shirt off and uh, just chill out because I'm so freaking hot. I've actually got a bead of sweat. Could be that um, I need to lose some weight and uh, stop fucking moaning, but uh, yeah, it's so freaking hot in here. So uh, I will bid you good day and uh, I'll see you later. Bonjour.